After staying in the south of France, in Arles, and then at the psychiatric hospital in saint remy de provence Vincent van Gogh settled in auvers sur oise a village in the outskirts of Paris. His brother Théo, concerned with his health, incited him to see the Dr. Gachet, himself a painter and a friend of numerous artists, who accepted to treat him. This church, built in the 13th century in the early Gothic style, flanked by two Romanesque chapels, became under the painter's brush a flamboyant monument on the verge of dislocating itself from the ground and from the two paths that seem to be clasping it like torrents of lava or mud. If one compares this painting with Claude Monet's paintings of the cathedral in Rouen, painted shortly afterwards, one can measure how different Van Gogh's approach was from that of the Impressionists. Our main goal with this treatment is to remove the synthetic varnish that was applied to the painting in the 1970s. There are many questions about what is an appropriate surface for a Van Gogh painting. The letters that he wrote to various people are inconclusive, it turns out, in terms of whether he varnished early things only, varnished some things later, didn't varnish. What we do know is that he never would have used a synthetic varnish, such as the painting has now. Our goal here in removing the varnish is to bring the surface back closer to something that Van Gogh would have recognized as a surface that pleased him at the time. Vincent Van Gogh Born March 30, 1853, Zundert, Netherlands, died July 29, 1890, auvers sur oise near Paris, France, Dutch painter, generally considered the greatest after Rembrandt van Riem, and one of the greatest of the post-impressionists.